I'm very proud of what she achieved. What she did was quite extraordinary. The fight for greater equality is a value that I've grown up with. There were nearly 1,500 women who joined the Scottish Women's Hospitals. When it came to World War I, Elsie felt that this was the time, this was the calling for women to be an equal. The War Office told her, my good lady, go home and sit still. What this crusty old official probably didn't realise was that she was going to have none of this. She formed what we now know as the Scottish Women's Hospitals. They served in France, Romania, Macedonia, and of course in Serbia. To think of all the, the thousands whose lives were saved and helped by her and the nurses who operated under terrible conditions near the front line. They were often ambulance drivers, stretcher bearers, cooks, orderlies, administrators. They became almost media darlings. There are various clips in the newspapers depicting this David and Goliath struggle and who was in amongst it all but these brave stoic women from Scotland.